Well, a black bear sighting in Burnsville has many in that area on edge. Uh, that bear was spotted early this morning near 42nd and Lac Levon Street. A homeowner snapped these photos as the black bear made its way through the yard. WCCO's Rachel Chapman has more on the sighting and what you should do if you see a bear. From the pictures I saw, it's about maybe a block and a half from our neighborhood. Karen Gilman has changed her routine after learning a black bear was sighted near her Burnsville home. I'm not walking in my park because that's right where I was seen is on my walking path where I usually take a walk every day. Someone spotted the black bear as he moved through a Burnsville neighborhood shortly before dawn. This isn't unusual this time of year to uh, get bear sightings. Usually, typically they're, they're uh, young males moving out looking for new territory. The Department of Natural Resources' Bob Fashionbauer says this urban wandering bear is not alone. There was also one seen in Castle Rock Township last night, you know, which isn't that far away. There was one seen in Hastings three days ago. The DNR is helping the average Joe track black bear sightings. Go on the app uh, and the DNR website and simply, you know, fill out the, the form, which is kind of putting the dot on the, on the map as to where you saw it, and other people can go on there and, and track the bear activity. Fashionbauer says black bears are afraid of people and they just want to be left alone. If you happen to cross paths with one. The first thing you want to do is, is don't run. So you, you want to walk, don't run. You want to give the bear an escape route. That's the most important thing. Moving your garbage inside and removing pet food and bird feeders from your yard will help make your home less attractive to black bears. They mainly move about at dawn and dusk, finding a cool place to rest during the heat of the day. In Burnsville, Reg Chapman, WCCO, 4 News. It's easier to uh, probably said than done. Walk, don't run. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I think the only good news is, like Reg said, they rest when it gets hot during the day. Good. 